We kick it off with what Corey calls a little tiger. This 27 inch 10 pound tiger is anything but little. Corey says it had a whopping 17 inch girth. That is a chunk. Here's another tank for you. George says his buddy was fishing at Lost Creek this year when he caught this seven pound splake. The DWR introduced splake to help control the chub population. This splake has definitely eaten a few chubs in its day. It took 15 years for Brian to draw his Panguitch Lake early bull elk hunt. And with the help of family, he was able to take this nice bull on the second to last day of his hunt. This is Connor on last year's youth turkey hunt. Connor did everything he could to ensure success, from scouting to waking up early and staying late to be just where he needed to be. On day three, he took this beautiful, long-bearded Tom, a memory he'll cherish forever. And finally, our winner tonight wow. shows us the exact moment he and his son Cody found his bull. Yeah, we did. We did. Brock had his 11-year-old son Cody on Brock's limited entry elk hunt last year. The hunt was tough. It was cold, and they were getting discouraged. But on the seventh evening of the hunt, Cody spotted two bulls just before dark. They made a quick stalk, and Brock tagged out on this great bull. Brock says it took them two days to get the bull off the mountain, and this bull is as much Cody's as it is his. A cool memory with your son there, Brock. Here's something else to help you remember your hunt, our big prize for having the Snapshot of the Week. Remember, submit your pictures or video, plus an explanation of your latest outdoor adventures online at ksloutdoors.com. The winner each week wins the handy and safe Camp Chef Redwood Fire Pit. You can check out this Camp Chef gear and more at Smith & Edwards. Plus, the weekly winner is also entered into our Ford Trucks quarterly Facebook giveaway for a Camp Chef pellet grill. With these Camp Chef accessories, take your chef-level cooking from the back patio to the back country. Eat better with Camp Chef. It's the way to cook outdoors.